time my dear students uh, here i am to tell you a very quick give you a quick sneak peek into icdas that is international caries assessment and detection system so in icdas d stands for detection of caries as according to the stage of caries procedure topography anatomy and restoration or sealant status so that is d that is detection of caries process that is present there and the a stands for assessment of caries process by the stage and activity of it so this icdas coding system is basically a two code system say x and y where x is considered to be decision 1 and y is considered to be the decision 2 here the x stands for lesion detection and y stands for lesion assessment now as i told you there are two decisions so this particular is the first decision that is that represents the digit x so you all can read over here what all are the scores for the first decision and then this is the decision y that is lesion detection you all can read here in the table what each score of the decision y means right so when we have detected we have a particular tooth and uh, looking at the tooth we will decide which score from the first decision is uh, appropriate for this and which score from the second decision is appropriate from it for it and that is how we are going to form a two code uh, two code uh, icds score for that particular tooth so for example if a tooth is restored with amalgam and also has a distinct cavity that is extending to the dentine then it will be coded as 4 6 so 4 will be the first decision as you all can see in the table 4 will represent or 4 is coded for something that has an amalgam restoration and 6 is when there is an extensive cavity that involves dentine so such a tooth is going to be coded as 4 6 as according to the two digit icds scoring system so i hope the icds scoring system is clear to you all